Hello guys, my name is Fox, I'm looking at part 26 of our Colonial Brunei series in Europa Universalis 4. Let's continue. So, in the previous episode we've been doing some more colonization as always, and just, you know, subjugating some more of the... of our little enemies, like Buton, I think, we subjugated in the last uh, game, or in the last episode, and now I want to attack Ternata, and also, between the episodes... Oh, Sunda has announced Brunei as our their new rival, again. Okay. Uh, does it mean that we could now have you as our rival? Let's do this, I guess. Uh, and yeah, I've been thinking that we probably need to do is uh, try to get ourselves some more expeditions. I don't know if we actually gonna have a chance to do this because uh, previous time we checked we actually had none, but. Let's go and try to recruit ourselves an explorer, but to do this we would need to have Diplo power, and I already spent it on uh, technology, looks like. Okay, so we would have to wait for ourselves to get to the 50 diplomacy, or Diplo points. Oh, our, uh, our ruler is so poor, and we also have no advisor in Diplo technology, unfortunately. Okay, also we have one of our colonists Free, so we should send him somewhere uh, to colonize. Also, have actually a ni freaking nice income. Let's go and uh, send it here, and we'll see how much chances we have to win this. Council of Verona, great. Also, Anzan no longer considers Diviet as a rival. I hope Altha is still rivaling the people I need. Yeah, Sack and Malak is still their rivals. And we're suffering some casualties because uh, transfer troops using the boats. Have a religious civil disorder on the Papal State. Good for them. Okay, uh, Posse start colonizing. And when we're gonna finish this war, it should be a pretty quick one. I think we could go and try to uh, get our army to protect Posa. We could gain piety, lose ducats, we could lose piety and gain ducats. And I want to lose piety, so let's do this. Great mission, I like it a lot. Also we need to uh, set the diplomacy window to be proper. Okay, that's better. Mm, now that Sunda is our rival again, it's actually go gonna be really convenient to attack them for some more power projection. Uh, we're probably not gonna be able to humiliate them really, because uh, as soon as I'm gonna take like a couple more provinces for them, they're probably gonna be, uh, stop being a an available rival for me. But actually, as long as they rival in me, I'm gonna be able to rival them. Uh, uh, I will, I'm gonna be rival them, but I don't know. Uh, how much time they are gonna be able to do this. Also, these guys have a two stars general, which is really surprising. Two, two against three, four. Uh, but we have twice as much troops, so I think we're gonna be fine. I hope at least. Also, don't you have anyone who could blockade me? I hope not. Let's go and let these guys repair for a second. Because, god damn it. Why do I need all these pop-ups from the Europe? Who cares about them? Uh, let's go and rep uh, let you repair a little bit, because I don't want to take my uh, lightships fleet for this. And you're gonna be protecting this straight for me, so uh, this guy not gonna be able to... Oh, we have a Night's Horizon. That's... Not a surprise. Looks like our colony is just gonna get wrecked, unfortunately. And we got 100 population in Posa. It's not actually timed r uh, really well. Okay, so do we have a claim on you? We do, so it will increase our pites by 25. God damn it. I don't need pites here right now. Mm, but, oh well. So. Take Ternate. Sounds fine. Let's go and destroy you. Also, we have a straight crossing. 
but we're still winning. Our colony got damaged and we just got wrecked, actually. Okay, so go and stack wipe this army and then we're gonna be able to come back and finish our siege. Could even detach, I guess, just not to suffer much attrition. We finished the ro or our royal marriage with Althaya ended. I hope they're gonna give us another one offer. So, what do we have in here? Three infantry and guns. Let's go and detach all the guns from here. Oh shit, I should not have consolidated you. It was a misclick, but oh well. And we're gonna go and give you some more cannons in here. And a general, actually. Yeah, we need a general because he actually have some siege bonus. Okay. And also these guys I think could even blockade. Yeah, that's gonna be a lot better. Oh, and the blockade now even been shown by a little sign in here. That's cool. Okay, so the siege is gonna finish pretty quickly. Or it should at least. Royal marriage from Althai, yes. I'm definitely gonna accept it. And we actually have enough Diplo points, so let's go and appoint an explorer, or recruit an explorer, and see if you could do anything for us. So, how much boats I need for the exploration mission, I don't know. Let's go and take, take like, I don't know, five barks. I'm gonna go here. The rest gonna get to protect and trade. And you. Yeah, now I could explore a lot more stuff. So, explore the waters of California. Yeah. Let's go and try to find uh, the America, because I should probably start colonizing there. And we finish the siege. Okay. Let's go and take this land. And some gold. Or actually all of your gold. Great. Now you guys could get together again. Mm, I hope I have not lost anyone by consolidating this. So, we need to transfer you probably back here and... Actually also we need to start making it into a core. Actually you could sit here and just uh, protect it from the uprisings. And you guys gonna be mod boat. So I hope you're actually gonna find America and I'm gonna have a chance to send an explo uh, a coloniza colonizator in there, or colonist. I don't know how far away is it gonna be from me, but cons uh, considering that Portugal is already <laughs> colonized like most of the Africa and France in here already, I think that uh, America is already swarmed by them, which is not great. Also, we could finish our offensive ideas. Get ourselves some discipline. Recover our memorial speed. Yes, please. That is a really great uh, finisher. Also, how's our policies now looking? Could get embargo efficiency and privacy efficiency. Nope. Doesn't look that great. Also, our current mission is turn turned Bengaluku into the city. Shoot be finished uh, relatively soon. Also, is this sync set... Um, set properly? Yes, it is, so... I don't know why I'm getting all the pop-ups from Europe, but I guess... I can't really do much about this. Also, I hope you guys actually gonna survive this... expedition. I actually suffering any attrition while doing it. Looks like not really, which is... Really great. I'm happy about that. So, while they're exploring, maybe I could use my colonies for some other thing. Also, how's our pricing looking? Second separatist, 7 years. And Batone, 13 years. Mm, I don't think they're gonna be much of a problem. Separatism is slowly going away, so... For 
percent unrest probably ain't gonna be enough for them to uh, to rise anytime soon. It's fine with, with me. Ben Galuka is slowly gr uh, growing. Hopefully it's gonna finish soon. Giving me my finished uh, mission. Also I could become the defender of the fate, but not gonna do this. I'd rather spend my money on something else, like boats maybe? More lightships? What do you think about this? Also, are you guys... Yeah, you are protecting trade. Good. Good, good, good. Yeah, there's not really that much money in this trade node, but... Actually, I could use some boats to, like, increase my... The amount of money I'm getting from CM, maybe? Or uh, the amount of trade power I have there. So, I guess I'm gonna just at least get to my uh, boats limit. To, to my naval force, naval force limit. So we're building 8, and we could afford how much? 12. So... Why is it not updating properly? 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay, that should be our force limit. And how's the exploration looking? Still haven't found America. How the hell? Okay, there is the coast of California. And we lost our general. I guess... Should we get another one right now? Well, we could wait actually on this. We're not gonna declare any wars right now, so... Maybe we could wait. Because who knows? Maybe the second one gonna die immediately as well. Maybe we could get even some more army tradition before this. Which is probably not gonna happen, but still. Okay, the coast has been explored, but unfortunately I can't see any land, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to send the colonists there. And probably not, because my uh, colonial uh, range is not really that high. 412. Yeah. Still not too much. But I think our next idea is gonna be something like expansion. And it should be increasing our distance. And also this uh, Diplo technologies. Be useful. Bengaluk finished. Great. Local development cost minus 15. Let's go and get yourself a core and... Go and just start colonizing the next thing because our army is already here. So it's gonna be useful to have you. Was legitimacy or prestige? We have more legitimacy, so I guess we could afford to lose it. And go get our army here right away. Even before the colonist arrives. Okay, that's fine. So, explorer, you need to come back. Native rising in here, that's fine. Is it natives or who? Or is it a Portugal? I don't think Portugal could get that far, and this is a little bit lighter green. Have some red there. I don't know who the hell is that. But I hope not someone who I couldn't resist. But I want to colonize this place really badly. I want to have my own uh, colonial nations. That would be really great. Only problem would be that their technology group is gonna be Chinese, so they're gonna be pretty weak, but they could always try to westernize. Okay, looks like our bots is finishing their construction. So let's go and try to get this part of the navy, and they're gonna be protecting trade in the CM trade node, and we'll see if it's gonna help with our uh, trade at all. So, actually I could just look through here, I guess. 1.5, 1 1.5. 1 mm. Okay, I don't know. Let me see. We're getting 7 point something. 7.48. And after CM, how much we're gonna be receiving? We're getting some increase, but... I don't know if it's actually paying for the bots or not. 
How could I see if it's gonna be profitable or not? I really don't know. Because in here it's actually showing. So increase our trade value from 7.6 to 8. Huh? And while increasing the cost and maintenance. Yeah, so we're actually losing some money on the maintenance, unfortunately. And what about this? Oh, that's actually increasing our trade value by quite a lot. Okay. Actually, go and send five more boats from here to the CM, and maybe it's gonna help with my income. I don't really know. I don't really know how to properly check it, but actually, no, our income dropped by quite a lot. 1.5, what if I were to send them all to Malacca? Outside declared some war, okay. Okay, I don't know. And this guy is actually not working. Okay, let's send them as well. Yeah, looks like protecting trade is just <laughs> is just working better than trying to steer using the boats. Okay, where is our explorer? He's still somewhere in there. Yeah, right near the uh, Siberia and stuff. Or uh, I don't remember how this place is called. Mm, truce with Malacca expired. Okay, and we could invest into the admin tech. Should we do it right now? I don't know. Our next IT group in the level 10. And I really want to get it. So I guess we're gonna be investing it. Why not? Don't really have much discount from our religion as always, but... Oh well. Lost a claim on Pahank. Also, how's our unrest looking? Already 50% for second separatists. But their unrest is dropping. So maybe we're gonna be fine. And we have an army right there, so... Could always protect if needed. Also, we have tons of force limits. Which we probably should... Be increasing. Increasing the size of our army. So... I'm gonna have two separate armies, looks like. So, this one. Eight, three, four. So, I could add like... Let's go and add two more infantry, one cavalry, two more cannons. And then we'll see what else we're gonna be adding there. We're here in five and we could get eight more, which is quite a lot. Got a corn tornado, great. Now we should probably start trying to convert it. It's gonna take a long time, but we still need to do this anyway. So, come on, armies. Okay, we will go here. How much supply limit you're gonna have in there? I'm not entirely sure. We have native rising again because our armies arrive. Okay, so we have 10, 4, 6. That's actually a pretty nice army. We could even get probably some more cannons, like 8 of them. And it's gonna be a pretty nice stock, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's actually go with 10, 4, 8. Sounds fine. And then we're gonna add the same into this second one. So, Explorer, are you going back home? No, you're still exploring. God damn it, it's taking you so much time. And our colony is actually not doing much in here. Uh, I guess we should send him somewhere else. We're trying to protect this place, but... I don't know if I could really do much about it. I could just go and 
increase the autonomy in here. There's only one province anyway, so... Mm, and I'm just gonna use this army to protect my colony in Posa, because Posa actually have quite a lot of base stacks, so I want to take it. And also it's attached to the rest of my stuff, and the, or actually... No, let's, star, let's start with Banjar. Could be moved in here, gonna be fine. I'm gonna start with, with Banjar, because as I already said, I want to finish this starting location. First, and... Explorer, where are you? I coming back home at all or not? And no. Okay, we have two more guns arriving. Okay, looks great. Ten, four, eight. Probably gonna protect us from insufficient support, which is useful. So how's unrest looking here? Ten years. Okay, pretty fine time. Yeah, go and. Get transfer to Barito, and then we're gonna transfer it to Panjar. And gonna start colonizing it. Actually, we could probably send the colonies right away. And actually, it is already time for me to have a break, guys, so I'm gonna be doing it right now, and we're gonna continue in the next episode. So, if you enjoyed watching this, you could leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And if you want to leave a comment, you should definitely do it. And I would answer you as soon as I could. So, later, guys. Bye bye.